Hello everyone. Uh, we're going to tie a sort of a Snelda today uh, based on the classic Cascade. So I have here uh, a metal tube, this uh, a sort of stainless steel metal tube. And the rear part of the body I'm going to make with a silver holographic braid. I'll tie that in and then just coat the tube with a bit of uh, super glue and then lay the braid into the glue. Standard Cascade has a tail which is a mix of uh, orange and yellow bucktail. So same here. Just want to take a bunch of that. Play with the tips. So what we want here is for this to go the whole way around. Our shank. And let the tie-in thread brown it in sort of like a loose wrap. Then I'm going to reposition some of that, and then whenever I tie it down a bit tighter, it should splay out a little bit. And then if I tie that back up against the braid, we should get a little bit of kick. So. This bit at the front I'm going to cut off with a cutthroat. And I just want to glue the tie-in points of that. So you can add a bit of flash now if you feel like it. Uh, I'm going to use a bit of uh, Crystal Mirage. I'm going to tie it in, double it over, tie it in on my side, fold it across, and then cut it off the same length. And then I should still have two pieces. I'm going to flip it upside down and tie those in underneath. Now I didn't go the full length of the hair with those, I sort of went back to about here because. I don't want them getting tangled up in the hooks. Right. So, next we're going to make a body at the front. I'm going to use a mixture of black synthetics and flash to create sort of a ball. I'll wrap into that. And add some more. Now we're looking at a little bit of a, a ball to make a kick here for the hackles that go in front. Okay. Right, so your uh, Cascade would have a black fox wing. What I'm going to do here is I'm going to use a black spay type hackle. So this is a cock pheasant rump dyed black. Double it over, tie it into the tip, fold it back, and we're going to wind that on here, just in front of that ball. So two more hackles to finish this fly. So first we're going to put on a yellow soft hackle. So same thing again, take a yellow soft hackle and double it. 
can't double, don't worry. It's just a bit neater, I think, if you double. And there is a video in my techniques section explaining doubling. Tie it in with the tape and fold it back. And then, now my hands might be in the way here, but it's on purpose as I'm stroking and holding the hackle back into shape as I wrap it. Of I like to fold stocks back on themselves and in the front we're going to add a hot orange soft tackle although you could also use like a hot orange badger or something here again same thing I'm going to double that nip the tip off tie it in by the tip Fold back and then same thing. Wrap that on in front of the yellow, just holding and folding it as you go. just remains to make a head so I'm going to glue my black thread wrap into the glue finish it off and that is our cascade snelled just remains now to finish the the head so uh, I'm going to use clear varnish on that and it'll probably take a few coats to, to finish that but that is our cascade snelda if you like what you see like and subscribe should now be a button over in the corner and uh, tight lines and see you next time.